morning, welcome back to another vlog. It is Sunday and I just thought we'd pick up the camera today and vlog what we get up to. So we've just mentioned the word walk, so we're literally about to get the dogs into the car and head to the beach because they love that beach. So we thought why not just go there while the sun is shining and I think it's meant to change um, later on. So yeah, it's still nice and sunny but there is a few clouds. Hugo literally loves going in his, well he loves going on walks but he gets in his crate and he doesn't really like the car but here he is waiting <laughs> in his crate to go on the walk. Are you excited? Yeah, we just like to kind of have him in the crate just for safety reasons and we're in the car. We do need to actually buy a proper car seat for the two dogs, but obviously Hugo, I'm just opening the blind by the way, um, Hugo obviously isn't the best at being like, like I don't know, we just can't get into the car without being in the crate, so we just said we'll just keep him in the crate for now and let's not change it up and stress him out. So I'm not going around the kitchen and it needs tidying as well, so oh, I just feel like it's never ending the, the jobs around the house, which is kind of annoying, but... Anyway, let's go, let's go and get Reek. Reek, come on, put your harness on, it's here, look. Come on, it's here. Look. He's literally at the front door waiting for Michael because Michael's gone to the car to obviously sort something out. Reek, come on, put your harness on. Good boy. Oh, are you excited, Hugo? Can you hear him crying? This is, the, this is what happens, isn't it, when you get excited for a walk. Reek, come on, put your harness on. Oh my good boy, aren't you? You got to stop crying, we're going now. Your heart your harness is broken. I think your harness is broken. Oh no, it's not. It's fine. Fixed. You ready to go for your walk week? Oh we should be go. We're in the car on the way to the beach. It's about what is it? Ten minutes? Eight minutes. What's that say? Ten. Ten minutes away. Um it's so warm and sunny, but we have the window shut just while I record this, but I'm gonna open it in a minute for the dogs, obviously. So he goes in his crate in the back and then we have Rico beside him because we're really good, aren't you? Brought a water bottle for the dogs and a little bowl because they're so thirsty after their little walks. And we always forget to bring water for them, which is like really bad parents. But yeah, just thought we'd try out the new tripod. Well, we have it since December, since Mike got me for Christmas, but I haven't used it yet. So I want to give it a go in my own car and we can go for like little drives and stuff like that. Which we go around it. Yeah, little chatty drives. I'm gonna go now because the sun is in my eyes and I wanna open the window and take my coat off because it's too warm. But yeah, we will catch up when we're at the beach. You say you don't wanna get in trouble, that you don't find cause you got me. I don't wanna break your little bubble, but you gotta wake up to reality. Cause I can see. Rick likes cows. Okay, Rick. Hugo's freaked. Big dog, you <laughs> He's backing away. Oh cows. god, oh god. Will we show everyone in Wicklow how you're getting on? We're back from our walk and the dogs are absolutely soaked from running in the puddles I'm sure you've seen in the, in the clips that I've just shown. But um, we're going to try and bat them. So this is usually eventful because we always... Hugo doesn't want to be picked up, but we're going to pick him up anyway, and we're going to bath him, but Rico's refusing to come upstairs. Come on. Come on. He's here now. Good boys. Come on, let's get to that. Yay. Do I get the towels, Mike? Oh, that's Thank you. Right, will we take your collar off? Will we? Oh, we take this off and get that in the wash, because it's covered now in sand, isn't it? Well, beach water. Sea water. Oh, what's up? I know. Do you like bath time or do you not like it? I don't know what you think of it, to be honest. You don't like it? No, take that off. Good boy. Oh, all gone. All gone. Where's your shampoo? Let me get my shampoo, will we? <laughs> Look at your little face. You're so cute. You're so cute, isn't you? Are you coming in? You coming in the bath too? Come on, in. <laughs> we'll have to try and grab him, won't we? We'll have to try and grab him. Okay. 
Right, wait, here's, here's your shampoo. What? Oh, look, you guys are as well, is he? Right, I'm gonna start Reese's shower now. the afternoon now and I'd say it's about four o'clock we just got so sidetracked with washing the dogs and um, as you can see they get absolutely soaked and the hair just goes everywhere so we had to use the hair dryer to blow dry them which they actually didn't mind which I'm surprised by um, and then we brushed them like literally I think they need brushing about 10 times over still because the amount of hair that came off um, they're definitely like shedding at this time of year but it's just everywhere and then I had to hoover about three times so it's just never ending but um, we're going to go to the shops now because I need to go and get petrol for my car because I'm in the office tomorrow and I literally got zero petrol and then we also need to get a few bits of food for the house. I'm not doing a full food shop because I get paid in two days and I think I like to wait until then and I can do like a proper shop. I think I might actually do an online order because I used to always do my shopping online and then I just kind of stopped doing it and I don't know why because it's so much easier and you don't have to go to the shop. So I think I might do that tonight. I might book the slot and just start adding stuff and then Tuesday I will, well no, hopefully I'd get the shop for either Wednesday, Thursday. I think that'd be the best time to get it but yeah, so just we need to get stuff to tie us over until then. Like, we have stuff for dinner today, stuff for dinner tomorrow. It's just basically all the basics, like milk, bread, stuff for lunches. So, yeah, I'm sorting my hair out. And my face is, like, so greasy, but I'm, like, I don't even care at this point. I'm just, like, as soon as I get home, I'm probably going to get a shower, wash my hair, and get ready for the week ahead. Michael's creeping up the stairs. You say that you don't want me to put the video on you, but then you do stuff like that that is make anyone ask questions but anyway yeah he's he's literally just crawled past i'm gonna go anyway and i'll show you when we get back what what we got if it's worth showing if it's exciting or not we're home hello we're home were you too good you a good boy rico oh you don't sit on that little mat do you like that mat you just got that new mat there actually yesterday because I kept walking in and bringing in muck. Um, well, the wet from the the rain, wasn't it? Oh yeah. Why are you backing up? It's okay. Right, let's go see what we got. So we're home from the shop. We went to Little in the End. So we just got a few bits, like I said, stuff that's gonna keep us going till we do a big shop. <laughs> I was slightly bad because I've been crazy. It's basically, I have to explain, it's that time of the month where it's not actually that time of the month but it's the time before that time of the month and that time of the month, the month it's a really bad time for me because i just get the worst cravings well not, they're not bad cravings but i just crave everything bad um, and they're not bad again like i said i just crave stuff that i probably shouldn't eat and be eating considering i want to lose a few pounds but i i picked up this belgian what is it cheesecake Oh, I was getting the small little ones and I seen this I was like I'll just get the big one which I know is really bad because now I'm going to end up having to eat the full thing not to myself but like I will have to eat it at some point so yeah can't wait to have some of this after dinner for dinner we're going to have like a Slimmer's chicken curry so I'm not going to make the chips from scratch because I don't really I can't really bother I don't even think I'm going to make chips we got like mini nans which I usually wouldn't do with that kind of chicken curry but Michael wanted nans, so we got them. I'm gonna put you down because my arm is actually really hurting doing this. Right, we're gonna have to crouch down. So yeah, we got the Peshwari nan, and then we're gonna make the Slimmers. It's the McDonald's curry. I don't know if you've had that before, maybe. You'll know what I'm talking about. Um, so yeah, that's for dinner, and like I said, I'm not gonna be having, I can't remember what I said, but basically we're having little mini nans with the curry. Oh, instead of chips, that was it. So yeah, that's what we got. That's all over the counters already. What else do I get? Oh, I just got like my little Slims because I like to have these for my lunches. If it is anything exciting, I'll show you. If it's not, I'm just going to put it away because I'm sure you really don't want to see like everything that we picked up. Okay, another weakness of mine is this fruit loaf. If you haven't tried this, you need to try it. It is unreal with butter on it, like toasted with butter. I could literally eat, I could eat that whole loaf. Like, <laughs> that's no word of a lie. My mom introduced me to this. I don't even want to look at the package and like see the calories on it. So I'm definitely gonna ignore that. But I just find this for in the evening, you know, if you have a cup of tea and you're still kind of peckish, instead of having a bar of chocolate or something like this, a slice of this toast 
it's just kind of just gonna get screaming basically what i kind of find it like is like a hot cross bun in a loaf version which i love hot cross buns as it is so yeah because you can only kind of get hot cross buns around easter Although I think I've seen them in the shop, so I don't know whether that's because we're kind of still Easter time. Who knows? But yeah, literally try this if you do like, um, I nearly said Easter eggs. Ones. That's all we actually really got um, in terms of new things. Like everything else is kind of the same that I probably would have shown in a food shop haul before. Um, when I do my big food shop, I will do a little food shop haul because they can kind of be interesting to see like what other people have idea wise for meals and stuff. But yeah, today I'm not going to show that because like I said, it's just the stuff that we picked up to give us a couple of days until we get our big shop and just to keep us like tidied over. Um, and again, it's not really anything too exciting. But yeah, I'm going to get this put away now and then I'm going to start the dinner. So to start the curry kind of wasn't in the mood for curry but michael was and i wanted to do like a sweet and sour but i was being lazy and i was trying to find the sauce um you know the jar of sauces and i couldn't find that in little so i just gave up and said i'll just have the curry too so that is what's for dinner and then once we have that we'll probably watch something on the tv i don't really know what to watch at the moment and um, there's nothing that's jumping out at me we tried to watch a series called beef that was recommended but I don't know, I just couldn't get into it. We watched like three episodes and kind of gave up, which maybe that's when it was going to get good. Who knows? But yeah, we, it just wasn't for us, I don't think. So yeah, we might see what is on the TV to watch. Um, and then this evening, I'm going to do a little bit of self-care, wash my hair, put a hair mask on, maybe a little face mask. Um, my nails don't need doing or anything like that. Like They're actually grown quite a bit since I last shown you. Remember I was showing you... I think I was doing them the blue colours. That was like two two times ago. And yeah, they come, they're coming on like really well, which is good considering I'm a nail biter. I'm just hoping that for my holidays in a few weeks that they'll be a little bit longer just so I can get the nice little square edge. And then I'll probably just do like a French, French manicure or just like a one kind of neutral kind of colour that goes with all my outfits and stuff um, on there. But yeah, it's another thing I really need to start planning out for my holidays. That can be another video probably. But yeah, I'm gonna go now because I'm literally just chatting crap. So sorry in advance. Well, I've already chatted it, but anyway, sorry. But yeah, I'll catch up with you after dinner and see what I'm up to or maybe show you what I am doing. So we've had our dinner now and I'm just gonna go get a shower and organize for tomorrow. I'm not gonna film anymore just because I wanna relax for the evening and don't wanna get the camera out again. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a like and subscribe if you're new. I'd love to have you stick around. But let me know as well if you do like watching these types of vlogs because I feel like I'm boring or we're boring, but <laughs> I don't know. We just like to, I like to post and show you what I get up to, I suppose. But yeah, I don't know when I'll be vlogging next. Oh no, I'm like, you're pan panicking now. <laughs> Michael's in the room with me now, so I'm just feeling a bit awkward. I don't know why because I don't know. I don't really like vlogging in front of people, which is probably something that I need to get over myself. Yeah. I always tend to end up laughing at him even though he's literally not even paying attention he's hanging out the washing so he's actually doing something for once anyway yeah feel free to give his podcast a listen i'll leave it in the description as well if you do want to go and go over there you go michael cheeky little plug but yeah that's enough from me i will catch up with you in my next video